So I'm wanting to put a, an AUX cable uh, from the wand um, and I believe the way to get into it is to drill out these little covers here. You can see I've already done one here and uh, I don't know if you can see but basically you can see the screw on the other side there. So what I'm going to do next is I'm just using this screwdriver uh, with a drill attachment. I'm going to do all four of these covers and then I'm going to try and undo the screws. Okay so when I was drilling the holes uh, these two actually they came out with the drill. You've just got to make sure you don't push down too far and that's actually made that easier because they're much bigger holes now. You can just about see the screw there. So I'm going to try and undo the screws and hopefully they'll come out without any problem. So um, all four of those came out um, with a, just the drill just yeah brought them out which was handy because it means the holes are nice and uh, big to get your screwdriver in. Um, so I've undone all those screws now and that piece lifts off. Now we've got to take out the rest of the screws in some of these holes so I'll do that now. I've just undone the screws from here and one that was on the front there and with a little bit of wiggling around this piece now comes off still attached on that green wire there so I'm going to try and see if I can see how to get to the speaker now I believe this slides slides up so I'm going to have a little look at that and see what I need to do there so with a little bit of teasing up that has now popped out of where it was sitting you can see that yellow cable is attached there so there is a little bit of slack but I'm just going to be careful not to you know not to put that under too much pressure just so I can get to the the two sides on the wire here I'm going to have a little look at that now and see what I can uh, how I can get to these wires so I've crudely spliced an aux cable onto the two cables to the speaker because I didn't have a soldering iron um, you can see the speaker still works the aux cable is going to uh, an ACA speaker which I normally use for stormtrooping um, but uh, when I turn this on that's without I don't even have to have this anywhere near full at all for it to be massively louder so I'm going to tape these up put it all back together and leave this cable sticking out somewhere so that I've got the option to use the amp if I want and hopefully it will work when I put it all back together I've put it all back together again well I've put that slotted that back down again and what I've done is I've made a little indent there just for the cable to, to come through so I'm hoping that will actually hold the cable a little bit as well so I'm gonna put the top back on now and hopefully everything else will be fine okay, so I've put it all back together again now and the speaker still works in the wand, which is a good sign. As you can see now, uh, this aux cable is coming out of the, the wand there. And it's going to this speaker at the moment. If I turn this in, oh, sorry. So you've got that speaker and the wand speaker working together. But this is obviously a lot louder. Oh. <laughs> Just ran out of time. So there you go, that's how you put an AUX cable on the uh, wand.